deadline extended. That's the news developers just got from Apple. Specifically, those companies offering digital classes or virtual events just got an extension. They won't have to pay that 30% standard commission on in-app purchases through June. In other words, they keep all of their sales for now. Why make this decision? Apple says it recognizes that COVID-19 is still very much a threat. That means a lot of events now still have to move from in-person to digital, saying, although apps are required to offer any paid online group event experiences through in-app purchase, we temporarily deferred this requirement with an original deadline of December 2020 to allow additional time for developing in-app purchase solutions. This deadline has been extended to June 30th, 2021. This is just the latest headline from Apple regarding its fee structure on the App Store. Remember, there was another big news earlier this month, too, when Apple announced that it's going to cut its commission to 15% for app developers making under $1 million on the App Store in 2021. That is going to impact a lot of people. About 98% of the developers that pay Apple a commission, according to Sensor Tower. With these moves, Apple's trying to keep its 28 million developers engaged, loyal, and motivated. It's also coming at a time when Apple, we know, like the rest of big tech, is under increasing scrutiny on Capitol Hill. One question is whether these latest moves could help ease tensions with some lawmakers who have raised questions about the App Store, and that is critical. That store accounts for an estimated 25% of that faster-growing, higher-margin services business. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.